At the U.S. Capitol, Senator Tom Daschle and Speaker of the House Dennis Hastert talk about the terrorist attacks and join other members of Congress in singing God Bless America. At a time like this, no words that we should utter today or this evening can help the hearts and souls and feelings of the victims and the families that were a part of this great tragedy that happened in this country today. Our prayers and thoughts and, th and, and words of, of, of consolation goes out to all those who have suffered. But one thing that happens here in this place <coughs> is when Americans suffers and when people perpetrate acts against this country, we as a Congress and as a government stand united <coughs> and we stand together. Senators and House members, Democrats and Republicans will stand shoulder to shoulder to fight this evil that's per been perpetrated on this nation. We will stand together to make sure that those who have brought forth this evil deed will pay the price. We're not sure who this is yet. But we have our suspicions. And when that is justified and when those suspicions are justified, we will act. We will stand with the president. We will stand with this government. And we will stand as Americans together <coughs> through this time. Thank you. Today's despicable acts were an assault on our people and on our freedom. As the representatives of the people, we are here to declare that our resolve has not been weakened by these horrific and cowardly acts. Congress will convene tomorrow And we will speak with one voice to condemn these attacks, to comfort the victims and their families, to commit our full support to the effort to bring those responsible to justice. We, Republicans and Democrats, House and Senate, stand strongly united behind the president and will work together to ensure that the full resources of the government are brought to bear in these efforts. Our heartfelt thoughts and our fervent prayers are with the injured and the families of those who have been lost. We know as a nation 
as we said, our thoughts and prayers are with those families and those injured and those who are the casualties of today's attack. We also remember those thousands of people who are rescue workers. We ask now that we all bow our heads in a moment of silence and remembrance. Thank you.